All right, I hope everybody is doing well. So I got a question, the, let's see. I have I had a question, someone asked me a question. Um, this person said, Antoine, what do you think about gay animals? So I honestly think that is a, a really stupid question, um, but I went ahead and uh, answered it anyway because I don't know this person's state of mind. He, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't laugh and um, I don't laugh at people who are um, born retarded or retardation, but some people are just spiritually retarded and um, they just pretty much are leaded and guided by a retarded spirit and the spirit just um, just speaks to them and you can see it manifest through these people. So, but I wanted to answer the question anyway and anybody who's listening as well. Um, so this was a question. What do you think about gay animals? So. What do I think about gay animals? So let's think about uh, what the most high thinks about gay animals or gays in period. Um, let's see, the Bible speaks that gay uh, homosexuality is a abomina abomination. So if it's an abomination, God, he, does, he disagrees with it. You know, he didn't, make, he didn't make gays. It was a practice done by humans that they practice... Um, I would say daily or however, I don't know, how, however they practice it or a lifestyle for them. I guess they, they like it and they just went on with the lifestyle. So, um, But the Bible does speak that it is an abomination because in the beginning of time, God created the animals and he created them in pairs. He created them both male and female. He didn't create them uh, male and male or female and female. He made uh, the female for the male, for the human race and for the animals as well. The reason why he made it like that was so that they could be fruitful and multiply, that they could reproduce. Now think of it this way. If you put a whole bunch of male animals on a island by themselves, they would die off. They would go instinct because the fact that they can't reproduce. They don't have the proper organs, the proper body parts that would allow them to... Um, they have the seed. The males have the seed, but they, they just don't have as uh, a female animal would to produce the child to conceive the child so that breed will die off same thing with the human race you put a whole bunch of gay men on the island by themselves they will die off the human race of their kind would die off because they're they they don't have women who could uh, conceive the, the child so there you have it that's the reason why god didn't make it that way he made it so that we could be fruitful multiply and um our generation can live on and our kids our children sorry our children will will continue to live on and their children will continue to live on and down the line and down the line they can experience this uh this beautiful life so that's beautiful every time you can take a deep breath in and breathe out that's that's just beautiful you know that that's life god has given us the breath of life just like he, when he breathed into adam he breathed into him a living soul so be grateful for that you know be grateful for that those things and um stop believing what everybody says go search out the truth for yourself and see the reason why god made things a certain way in certain order because god is a god of order he's not a god of disorder everything um he makes is in order just like the sun rises and then the sun sets and then the moon rises and then the moon sets you know there's, there's all order the sun doesn't want to be the moon the moon doesn't want to be the sun god made the the sun the greater light for the day and the lesser night for the night so there's all order reasons why he made that for signs and it's for all things um for now i won't say for all things sorry excuse me he made them for his reasons his beings the reason why he made them talks about that in the bible um but don't want to get too far off in the topic so what do i think about gay animals it's a dumb question but i hope that helps you out the fact that the reason why god didn't make animals gay or humans gay he made them straight both male and female so that they could be fruitful and multiply and replenish the earth that's one that's that's a purpose that they serve right there so uh but our main purpose is obeying god um and stop obeying these uh, wicked spirits um, speaking to you. So a lot of people need to be set free. And I hope this sets some of you free. Um, shalom.